Hey, in today's video, I'm going to start the demolition of the bus. If you haven't noticed already, I'm using a 360 camera, and I went ahead and bought this camera because I wanted you to be able to see the entirety of the inside of the bus. One of the things that I don't like whenever I'm watching videos on YouTube about how to do things is that the, the camera angle is so focused in on what they're working on, I can't see the context of what they're working on. So they're zoomed in on a little part, and that's great, but I also can't see where does that part fit in on the overall scheme of the bus or whatever project it is that I'm watching. So hopefully this will give you a little bit more insight on the bus. Maybe not all of the videos will be 360 videos, but at least some of them, when it makes sense, will definitely be a 360 video. So the first thing that you'll notice um, is that I've got to take off these overhead compartments. If you look behind you, you'll see that I already removed the overhead compartment, overhead compartment on the other side. Um, and I did that just so I could make sure I knew what the procedure was for removing it. And so now I'm going to go ahead and take this one off. The first thing I'm going to do is take off this trim piece, which covers all of the mounting bolts for this overhead compartment. Now that I've got that trim piece down, there are some bolts right behind here on this lip that screw into the overhead ribs of the uh, bus, and they look like this. They're just self-tapping metal screws that screw into the ribs, and there's a big washer. So once I remove all of those, I believe there's some right up here, and then there should be some in the back there, and then, I can be, then I'll be able to take down this whole um, overhead bin. So let's get to work on that. So I'm going to be using um, a drill adapter for a quarter inch socket um, extension with a, with a wobble on the end so I can get all of these off pretty quickly. So there's the bolt. Okay, now with uh, all of the, the bolts on the top, you can see it's pretty much wanting to come down all on its own. So there are some bolts on the back side that screw into the sides of the bus, um, and that's the only thing right now keeping this up. So I'm going to go ahead and remove this other trim piece uh, on the back, which will reveal those bolts on the back that need to be taken out. Okay, so what you can see here, if you can see that, there's another one of those bolts right on the back. Here's that rib that goes in there, and so there's one of these uh, probably every, looks like 24 or 30 inches or so. So I'm going to take all of those. This is the back side of this fiberglass uh, case.
So there was a speaker in the back that was kind of holding it up. And a speaker in the front. But again, I don't really care about anything that's in here. I'm trying to gut it out. And so that's what I'm doing. All right, so I've gotten the overhead compartments down. Um, they're fiberglass with a little metal rod. I'm going to just take a sawzall to them um, and then cut them up into, you know, five, six foot sections and throw them away, put them in my truck, take them to the dump. Uh, the seats um, are bolted in with uh, four five-eighths bolts. And um, in order to take them out, you just un undo the bolts and then pull them out. So I'm going to take those seats out now. One bolt. Okay. Alright, now those bolts are out and this seat pretty much just comes loose. Now, you can see on the wall there is a little rack. It's very similar to what electricians use to mount panels on walls. And so, what I'm going to do is eventually I'm going to take all of these seats out and then I'm going to take out all of the wall panel coverings, the headliner, and all of the floor boards. I believe I'm going to take all the floors out and put new floorboards in. But I wanted to thank you for watching this video. Uh, it kind of just shows you the process of demoing these main components of the bus. Uh, I'll go ahead and off camera take them all out. Um, I do want you to let me know if you liked the 360 video camera and give me some thoughts about what you think, uh, maybe some ideas that you think I should incorporate into this bus. Um, stick around, this is going to be a great video series, and I hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.